We're going to be doing a video for the palpation of abductor digiti minimi, and I'm going to use the word manus. Technically, there's an abductor digiti minimi of the foot, which is referred to as pedis. So for this one, abductor digiti minimi manus. Abductor digiti minimi is originating off of two items. The first bony item is this small bone on the palm of the wrist. It's in your proximal carpal row, and it is called pisiform. So I'm doing a full circle around pisiform currently right now. So this will be its bony origin. The second origin is actually on a tendon, and the tendon is just proximal to pisiform, and this is for the muscle known as flexor carpi ulnaris. I'm gonna have my partner do just a little bit of ulnar deviation while I resist her just a little bit. Good, and right there is that tendon of flexor carpi ulnaris. As we activate this muscle, we'll actually be able to see this tendon tightening up as it goes through its action. So what I'm gonna have her do is bring her pinky far away as she can and then bring it back and then do that on her own. You can see right in this area, go ahead and bring it all the way out. Good, the tightening up right in that tendon space. So the origin of the tendon of flexor carpi ulnaris as well as the bone pisiform. The muscle travels on the outer side of the hand so the most medial part of the hand, so we can actually do a nice pincher grasp on one side and follow it all the way down. Now if she actually relaxes her hand as much as she can, good, you'll actually see, and oftentimes as you're pulling on it, the pinky moving itself. So the belly of our muscle is right in here. I'm going to have you go through that action a couple times for me, good. And follow that, passing the metacarpophalangeal joint right here and inserting right there on the medial side, base of the proximal phalanx of this fifth digit here, okay? Its action, very, very minimal at the carpal metacarpal joint and almost exclusively of abduction of the fifth digit at this metacarpal phalangeal joint. And all of our hypothenar muscles here are innervated by the ulnar nerve. 